how are we doing guys? It's your old buddy Baba Ganesh here. And we got hot feet in the background. We are, uh, yeah, we got a good trip here guys. It is Saturday, uh, May 28th. Uh, it's approximately 7 p.m. We are hitting the trail, baby. We got a full week in front of us. We're doing, so we're gonna be doing a full seven days, approximately 65 miles. Uh, and we got Fernando's dog here with us, with us as well. So hopefully she, she survives the heat. Tonight, today we're only doing about a half a mile in. There's this really nice little overlook, so we'll have a beautiful sunset and everything. Um, we wanted to get up here tonight so that tomorrow we can start nice and early uh, without having to get up super, super early just and hope that we make it out here in time. Um, so this just makes things a little bit easier on us. So all right, guys, we got a great trip in front of us, a full week. We're gonna be doing the roller coaster in Virginia, the West Virginia section. Uh, going through Harpers Ferry and finishing up at the uh, Washington Memorial all the way up in Maryland. So let me get up to this campsite, guys. I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. Baba Ganoush out. Boom! Well, how to ho, Ranger Joe. It's Baba Ganoush here. With hot feeds. So, yeah, we, we got the camp. It's all set up. I mean, look at this view that's behind us. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, you can see the tent set up behind us in this really, really tall grass, which is pretty nice. It gives us some good cushion underneath our tent. We got Penny Lane sitting over here. How are you doing, Penny Lane? Say hello to the camera. So, yeah, guys. So, uh, yeah, it's 20 after 8 right now. We still got plenty of sunlight. Um, it's a great spot. It's beautiful out here. It's really warm, too. So, we're probably going to be opening up our tents full on, that's for sure. Tomorrow, we got a 14.7 mile day. It's going to be a long day. We're going to get started nice and bright and early. Um, but the terrain is actually not too tough. I've done this section before. Um, and I've done it in really no time at all. So I'm not worried. Uh, I do have a little bit of a head cold. He's fighting allergies. So we are a little bit nasally right now. Can't breathe all that great. So uh, it is what it is. I didn't want to postpone this. We planned this for so long. Like five or six months at least we've been planning this. So I'm not about to postpone this because of some little head cold. It's pussy shit. So all right, guys. We're going we're gonna to sit here on this bench. Just relax a little bit, enjoy ourselves, enjoy the view. Have a great night tonight. It's a beautiful night. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Baba Ganoush out. Yeah. Don't bother me. I'm filming. How's it going, guys? Sorry, Fernando's being an asshole. He's interrupting me. But, uh, yeah, so it's uh, just about 8 o'clock in the morning. We're going to be getting going in about 5-10 minutes. It is a beautiful morning so far. Take a look behind me, guys. It's a beautiful background. So we got a good good long day today. Um, so we're getting, our, getting going nice and early so we can just take our time. But I figure we'll probably get into camp around 5 or 6 o'clock tonight after a 14, just over a 14 and a half mile day. So, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's going to be a little bit humid today, but we'll deal with that as we've done in the past. You know, I'm more concerned about the overall heat, really, and that's really not supposed to be that much of an issue. Maybe some thunderstorms this afternoon, possibly, around 9 o'clock. So we'll uh, hopefully we get into camp before that happens, get all set up and everything. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, all right, guys, let me, uh, let, me put my, let me put you away. Let me get my stuff together, strap on my boots. And uh, get out on the trail. Talk to you guys soon. Baba Ganoush out. Well, hi there. Baba Ganoush here. I got hot feet behind me. Hello. So we're already uh, just over four miles into it, and it hasn't even been two hours. So we're making really good time this morning. As you can see, I don't have my shirt on right now because it's humid as hell. And I feel like staying a little bit cool today. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh! <laughs> Squeeze my titties together. <laughs> I'm probably going to add that part out. <laughs> Why? Right, yeah. So, we're coming up on Dick's Dome Shelter in probably about 2.3 miles, I'd say now. Um, we're going to stop there, refill on water because we're going through it pretty quick today, and have a quick snack. Um, you know, again, 14.7 miles. We're averaging over two miles an hour right now. We're doing good. We're doing real good. Real good. So, so all right, guys, let's get going here. We'll uh, put some good miles behind us, get up there. I'll catch up with you guys when we get to the shelter. We'll be stopping at Dick's Dome Shelter. Talk to you guys soon. Bob Ganoush out. Boom! Hey. <laughs> oh, you 
you did. <laughs> well, how we doing, guys? So we, uh, yeah, we're down at Dick, St Dick Stone Shelter. Uh, we didn't walk all the way down to the shelter because it's literally like 0.3 miles off the trail. So it's not worth going all the way there and coming back just for a snack and refill. So we're filling up water re real quick here. We already had our snacks. Uh, so yeah, we're just gonna refill real quick and get back out on the way. Uh, this is like a six and a half mile mark. We got about 8.6 miles left to go. And it's 11.45. So we are making really good time. We estimate anywhere between 4.30 and 5.30. We're gonna get into camp tonight uh, to make things nice and easy. Get there nice and some good time left. So all right guys, I'll uh, catch up with you guys when we stop for lunch or something. Talk to you guys soon. Bye, we're gonna see you out. Boom. Bravo. <laughs> How we doing, guys? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, <laughs> we made up to the Paris Overlook. Sorry, my cold is just, it's tough doing this in this humid with the head colds. But we made it to the Paris Overlook. It's really beautiful behind me. We just stopped to have lunch at this picnic table sitting right here. You know, there's other people sitting here with their dogs and stuff as well. Um, so they're really nice people just chatting a little bit. So uh, we got 5.3 miles left to go. It is just after 2.30. We figure we're gonna, gonna get in just after five o'clock probably. So I'll catch up with you guys further on down the trail when we uh, you know, come up to a good section or something. Talk to you guys soon, Baba Ganoush out. Well hi there, it's Baba Ganoush again. Got hot feet behind me, Penny Lane down below. So we're uh, about 1.3 miles out from camp. It is uh, just after five o'clock. So we're making really good time, getting in nice tonight. We got some clouds coming up overhead. We're expecting thunderstorms tonight. Uh, so that'll be kind of nice though. It'll cool things down because it's been super humid all day long. I've been, I've been spitzing like a spots. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's gonna be a good night tonight. Thunderstorms I think start around like nine or something like that. Uh, so we're gonna get to camp, set up our stuff as quick as we can. And then uh, go ahead and you know finish finish our last meal, and go ahead and do our stuff for the night. Get a nice early sleep tomorrow. We uh, yeah we go through the roller coaster tomorrow. It's gonna be a nice. It's gonna be a brutal day. Warm, humid. Might even rain tomorrow. Who knows? We'll see what happens. I'll talk to you guys soon. Love a ganoush out. Yeah, how we doing guys? Baba Ganoush. It is uh, Monday morning. Happy Memorial Day, everybody. So we got uh, 9.4 miles in front of us. We're going to be starting the roller coaster today. Not going to be too bad. Uh, we do. It's supposed to be raining in and out, possibly, so we got pack covers on nice and early. Now we can just keep it moving. Uh, yeah, I got some rain last night. Wasn't too bad, but, you know, things, rain flies and so on and so forth are soaking wet today. Um, so I mean, we'll see if we can get to camp early, maybe dry things out, hopefully, if we get a chance. That'll be kind of nice. But otherwise, I mean, we've, we've dealt with worse before. Worse yeah. things have happened. So, alright guys, let us, uh, let's get going here with some good miles behind us. Catch up with you guys down the trail. I think we got some good overlooks coming up, so we'll hopefully get some good pictures for you guys. Talk to you soon. Baba Ganoush, out. Good day. Well, hi there. Bob Ganoush again. Half feet behind me. Yeah. So it's uh, just after 11 o'clock. We've been hiking for two hours. Um, our estimation, we've gone probably ooh, a little over three miles. Uh, so we're making pretty good time. Uh, you know, it's a little humid out today. Pretty warm, but it's not raining. So that's nice. Uh, we got the rain covers kind of floating off the back of the packs right now, drying out, which is working pretty well. Uh, we're going to be stopping up at the Sam Moore shelter and probably just taking packs off, switching these around so they can dry out better. Maybe we'll grab lunch, maybe we'll just continue on. We haven't really made that decision yet. But we're only doing 9.4 miles today. Uh, it's just a lot of elevation changes. It's the roller coaster. I mean, what do you expect? So we're moving at a good pace though, which is nice. It's nice. It's nice. 
So alright guys, let me put you away, let me get, uh, let us get some good miles behind us, and I'll catch up with you guys further on down the trail. Baba Ganoush, out. How are we doing guys, Baba Ganoush here. It has been a long, hot, humid, and very tiresome day out on the roller coaster. Yeah. Whew. A lot of elevation changes. Legs are a little bit tired, but we're doing okay. We're two miles from camp. We stopped a little bit ago to have kind of like a late lunch. Uh, refuel a little bit. Figured that would be good for these last couple miles here. So we're not going to stay at the shelter site, so we passed Sam Moore Shelter. We're going to be staying at the campsite over near, I think it's the Bears Den Hostel. There's a campsite over near there. Uh, so we're going to be staying at that location. So tomorrow will be a little bit shorter. Otherwise, you know, instead of a 13 or a 14 mile day, uh, we're looking at about a uh, 11 and a half mile day. So it'll be a little bit easier on us tomorrow. So, all right, guys, let me put you away for a little while. It's really, really warm. Whew, it's really humid. And we're getting close to camp. Yeah, warm? Holy smokes. All right, guys, I'll check in with you guys soon. Baba Ganoush out. How we doing, guys? Bubba gonna share. So we just got into camp. This is uh, a little bit, a little bit south from uh, Bears Den Hostel. So we're gonna get set, set up behind there. It's 5:30 right now. We're here nice and early tonight. Um, long ass day. So we're gonna see how things come along. So we got a good few hours before sundown. Um, we're not gonna have any fires or anything tonight, but we are gonna, you know, get ourselves set up nice and early. You know, eat kind of early as well, so that way we can just relax for the rest of the night. Uh, a lot of, not a lot of miles today, only 9.4 miles today, but it's the roller coaster, so it's this all day long. So we're pretty exhausted. So, all right, guys, let me put you away. I'll catch up with you guys at dinner. Baba Ganoush, out. Hey, how we doing, guys? Baba Ganoush, good morning. Beautiful Tuesday morning here. We got Freddie eating breakfast over in the background. I got my biscuits and gravy. <laughs> delicious shut up penning lane so um yeah we're uh it's just uh, about a quarter to eight right now we're eating we're gonna pack up and get going uh we gotta finish off the last couple miles of the roller coaster and then we have a pretty easy day up in west virginia today uh we'll stay we stayed at the david lester memorial shelter really nice shelter you guys have seen that in my videos in the past um so hopefully it's not busy we can just stay in the shelter because we got a long day tomorrow Otherwise, you know what, what they do, we'll just set up like the rain flies because it's supposed to be a beautiful day, a beautiful night, and we don't need them. So, all right, let us uh, finish our breakfast, get our stuff packed up. Hopefully, we can be out of here by 9 o'clock, get out on the trail. That way, we can just take our time, have a nice, relaxing day, get into a uh, shelter site tonight. Yeah, guys, uh, I'll talk to you soon. Got to finish my breakfast. Get a, get a good, hearty breakfast in me. Get some energy in me. Get up and on the way. Baba Ganoush, out. Well, all right, all right, guys. We're uh, a little over two miles into our day so far. Uh, it's just 10.30 right now. So, I mean, good uphill right in the beginning. Um, and obviously, early morning, we're taking it nice and easy. So, we're moving a little bit slow. But now we got some flat terrain. Our legs are nice and warmed up. So, we've been noticeably picking up the pace. So we're doing pretty good today. Humidity's down. It's a beautiful day so far. Expecting a clear night tonight as well. Uh, so it'll be nice. So we got our clothes hung off the back of our packs already. Trying to get these dry. If they're not dry by the time when they, we get to camp, uh, which most likely they will already, uh, we can just hang them up. Uh, so uh, yeah, we probably have about nine and a half miles left to go, but only a couple more miles left of the roller coaster and then it's easy pickings up in West Virginia. <laughs> Why did you say? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, roller coaster is pretty brutal, especially with the humidity that we had yesterday. Woo! 
But, however, on a good note, we did luck out with the rain last night. Big time. Seriously, we literally watched the dark dark thunderclouds roll below us. Like, right around us, pretty much, yeah. And because we looked at our phones, we had perfect cell phone reception. So we looked at our phones and it said, you know, bad thunderstorms for a few hours last night. Not a single drop of rain. It was perfect. So we were able to dry out our clothes pretty well. It was, uh, got a little bit damp last night, so they didn't fully dry out, but they were okay. And they pretty much got sweat through already, so it doesn't even matter. <laughs> so, alright guys, we got a little bit left of the roller coaster. I'll pick up with you uh, a little bit up ahead. When we stop for lunch, stop to grab a drink, or if we got a good overlook there. Talk to you guys soon. Baba Ganoush out. How are we doing guys? Bob Ganoush and Hot Feet again. So we stopped at this really nice water source. Uh, I've camped here a couple times. Really good water source. Refill real quick. We we're just about to finally exit the roller coaster. Yes, Lord. Uh, and then we got an easy uh, 7.4 miles, I guess, back to uh, or to uh, camp tonight. Uh, so yeah, I mean, we killed that pretty good. Uh, it's just after 12.30 right now, which means that 7.4 will go by nice and easy. Means we'll I figure we'll probably get to camp around like 4, 4.30. Taking our time, we're going to stop and have lunch and everything as well. So, all right, guys, let me, uh, I'll check with you down the trail. Uh, we'll stop to have lunch in probably the next couple miles. Get going from there. Talk to you soon. Baba Ganoush out. Well, how we doing, guys? So we are finally out of the roller coaster. Yes, Lord. We're into West Virginia for a nice, flat, even terrain. Uh, a couple little ups and downs, but nothing, nothing crazy like the like the roller coaster, anyway. Um, so we got uh, yeah, about seven, seven point two miles or so until we get to camp tonight. It is just going on two o'clock now, so we got plenty of time there. We'll probably get in. All right, our usual time, 5.30, 6 o'clock, um, and it's the uh, David Lesser Memorial, so there's plenty of tent sites around, lots of space, really beautiful shelter, so if there's not too many people in the, staying in the shelter, maybe we'll just shelter tonight, otherwise maybe we'll just do the tents if there's going to be a whole bunch of people. So I'll catch up with the guys further on down the trail. I think we might have a view coming up, I believe, I think it's Buzzard Rocks. Uh, so I'll catch up with you guys further on down the trail then. Baba Ganoush, out! Well, all right, all right. It's Baba Ganoush. It is uh, Wednesday morning. It's resupply day. It's a beautiful morning so far. It's nice and cool. Keeping us, not, us nice and cool. We got up nice and early. We got going at 8 o'clock this morning. Uh, it's just at, just past 8 o'clock, so we've been already uh, putting putting a little bit of good distance between us and the uh, shelter. Uh, so we're, uh, yeah, we're heading to Harper's Ferry. We're going to resupply there. Uh, so we have really nice, easy terrain in front of us, so we're just kind of taking our time this morning get our legs warmed up you know we know that this is easy terrain so we can do the time no problem uh, and then we're gonna be heading on up into Maryland tomorrow is a zero day the long-awaited zero day <laughs> after the brutal roller coaster for the first few days this week uh, so our legs are a little bit tired but you know we're doing we're doing pretty good though definitely we're well fed I'll tell you that much uh, had a really good breakfast this morning Fred would you have a breakfast Oh, some biscuits and gravy. I had that as well. Ooh, it was delicious. Really filling. Penny Lane here. She's doing real well. She's got some renewed energy this morning as she keeps trying to sprint in front of us. 
as we keep trying to pull her back so she doesn't tire herself out too early. You go for, you'd figure being out on a few days, being out on the trail for a few days, she'd understand this, but no. So all right, guys, let me put you away for a little while. I think we got a, uh, we got some good spots coming up in front of you, coming up in front of us. I'll pull you out again, talk to you for a little bit. Ah, oh, beautiful day, beautiful day. We uh, set up the tents awesome last night, by the way. We uh, didn't even put the rain flies on, so I was able to just look clear to the sky. Got a little bit chilly last night, but I just turned my sleeping bag uh, quilt style. Just opened the whole thing up, used it as a blanket, with no problem. Fred here was in his sleeping bag liner, kind of curled up, hoping for the best. <laughs> no, he was fine. That no, was a good night last night. So, all right, guys, I'll talk to you soon. Bob, we're going to shout. Well, how are we doing, guys? All right, so we are at 4.8 miles, and it's not even 10 o'clock yet. So in less than two hours, we've gone 4.8 miles. So we're doing approximately two and a half miles an hour today, which is nice. Got this beautiful view behind me, as you can see. Uh, view behind me the other way as well. Really nice area. It's good to get it out of the tunnel a little bit. There's a little freaky underneath the power lines because they are buzzing. But we're making good time. Woo! It's nice and cool this morning, which is good, but it's going to warm up this afternoon, that's for sure. So it's nice that we're getting these miles out of the way. So, all right, guys, let me put you away. Let me get up to another nice little area. I'll take you out. Or we're making really good time. You know, I might not take you out till I get to the Shenandoah River. We'll see what happens. Talk to you guys soon. Baba Ganoush out. Well, how we doing, guys? So we made it to the Shenandoah River, Harpers Ferry. It's an absolutely beautiful day. We got some people uh, kayaking in the background over there. Got some people fishing off in the distance too. So we made it here a really good time. It's just after 12 o'clock. We're going to go. We're going to get resupplied. Maybe stop for a burger. Get some food back in us and then on our way to uh, the Ed Garvey shelter up in Maryland. Uh, pretty easy terrain besides this one uphill. So I mean, I'm not worried on time whatsoever. Alright guys, let me put you away and let's get into town, resupply, and get on our way. Baba Ganoush, out. How are we doing guys? So we stopped through Harper's Ferry already, resupplied. Uh, we also stopped at uh, Bar and Grill, had a burger real quick, had a beer. It was delicious. Uh, so now we're on our way. We're walking along the Shenandoah River here. We got a few miles of just completely flat ground. I can't remember the name of this particular biking trail. Um, but yeah, a few miles of this. Uh, we only have, and it's 10 after 2 right now, we only have about six and a half, seven and a half, six and a half to 7 miles uh, until we get to uh, camp tonight. And then tomorrow's the zero day. Woohoo! Zero! Not going anywhere. We got plenty of snacks for tomorrow. We're just gonna relax, rest the rest the uh, rest the legs a little bit. Looking forward to it. Oh man. So yeah, Harpers Ferry, the historical district is absolutely beautiful. They got some really good places in there for food as well. So if you're looking for a good rest stop or good resupply point, I would definitely recommend going to there. It's a lot of really really nice places. So, all right, guys, let me get some good miles behind me. I'll put you away. Talk to you guys uh, when I get up to a good little area or something. Talk to you guys soon. Baba Ganoush, out. What's going on, guys? Baba Ganoush. So we made it up to the Weaverton Cliffs. As you can see, I have a beautiful view behind me. This, honestly, is one of the most breathtaking views along the whole AT. Well, at least the miles that I've hiked anyway. I've seen some great ones, and this one just is unbelievable. So I got Fred here, Penny Lane in the background, exhausted. Yeah, she's tired. But yeah, it's, it's definitely well worth it. We got two mile, no miles left to go. We'll get there without a problem. So let me put you away, give you one last good view behind me here. Then we'll get up to the shelter. I'll talk Penny to you guys Lane. soon. Penny Penny Lane. Out.
Well, how the hell there? <laughs> How's it going, guys? Baba Ganesh. So we made it to the shelter last night. Awesome shelter. Really nice. We're actually in the upstairs section right now. Uh, so you might be able to get a good look at everything. We've got our gear set up in the back corner. My stuff is over here. Fernando's over here. we got the whole upstairs to ourselves. This is um, the Ed Garvey shelter. So they have a lower section down below. Hold on a second. So they have a whole lower section down here. So as you can see. And then you have the upper section, which has these really cool windows in front of us. So you get a good view. And then you turn around and then you see us. There's a door in the background with a deck on the back as well. Let me take you outside. Yeah. So they even have like a back here as well. It's just a really nice shelter. So this is where we're taking our zero day. So we're just relaxing all day today. Uh, catching up on some rest, you know, after doing the roller coaster, putting a lot of miles behind us in just the first few days. Um, you know, we're not through hikers. <laughs> you know, we're in pretty decent shape for section hikers, um, but, you know, not not as good a shape as we probably should have been. So we're just relaxing today. It'll be kind of nice. So we're just going to snack up, get plenty of food, get plenty of food, probably get some extra sleep and stuff as well. Penny Lane. Fernando's dog is already back asleep. So it's just going to be a boring day, but a relaxing day. So I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. Maybe when we go to get water, or uh, we just have to have lunch or something like that. So I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye bye, news out. So how are we doing, guys? It is uh, Friday morning, the last full day we're out on the trail, unfortunately. Got a little bit of crappy weather. It's it was raining all night. It's supposed to rain on and off during the day. But you know what? We kind of lucked out big time during the week with really nice weather. So one day of partial rain isn't so bad. It'll fill up all the streams and everything again, which is nice. So just as a side note to you guys in the future, staying at shelters, um, when you get up in the morning and there's other people asleep, be quiet. <laughs> We stayed in the shelter last night and we had some really inconsiderate people sitting there. I mean, they're up at 6 o'clock in the morning and the whole group of them were sitting around telling jokes, laughing, and there's still probably about four or five of us, you know, trying trying to get a little bit of rest. Uh, and it's not just myself. There are a couple through hikers sitting there who are trying to get a little bit of rest in the morning. And these people were just sitting there wailing away. It's like, come on, guys. Otherwise, <sighs> otherwise it's going to be a good day. Nice and cool this morning. It's just turning 8 o'clock now. We only got nine miles to go. So we're going to take our time today, get there nice and early, just relax all afternoon. So I'll talk to you guys further on down the trail. Bob, we're going to shout. So how are we doing, guys? So we made it up to Gathlin State Park. We got the War Correspondence Memorial over here and everything. It's really beautiful. Uh, this is where I parked a, a while back and hiked north from here. Uh, it's in the previous video. You guys can take a look. <clears throat> so. This is 3.7 miles from the previous shelter, and we've all been hiking for an hour and 15 minutes. Uh, so you see what kind of ground we, you can cover. And we're not even we're not even in fifth gear. We're maybe just cruising at like third or fourth gear right now, um, and we're still making that kind of time. So we got a uh, we got six miles in front of us, I think. Five and a half, six miles in front of us. Gonna make really good time. Get there nice and early, and just relax all afternoon. Which will be really nice. And then tomorrow's our last day out. Tomorrow we only have like three and a half miles. So, all right, guys, let me catch up with you on the way down the trail. Just talk to you guys soon. Bob, we're going to Yeah, how are we doing, guys? So, <laughs> it's not even 10.30 in the morning yet, and we're approximately three, three and a half miles from shelter. Uh, we're coming up on uh, a good, nice little overlook where we'll stop and have just a quick, light lunch, and then continue on. Get to camp nice and early tonight so that we can get stuff set up and just relax for the rest of the afternoon. Um... You know, we were hoping to sleep in a little bit, but things didn't work out. So, so we decided to get up and just get moving. Um, so hopefully the people who stayed with us last night, uh, it sounds like most of them are going to continue past us to uh, the Dahlgren Backpack Campground where there are showers and stuff like that. Uh, so hopefully we can get a nice quiet camp tonight. Get our privacy. And uh, so we're, we're looking forward to that. So, all right, let me, uh, let me get going here. It's going to be an early day today, get there nice and early, relax for the rest of the afternoon, get to enjoy it. 
it's a little bit humid out today it's really humid out today but it's not raining and that's that's nice um so we've been kind of really lucking out with the weather this whole week so all right guys let me put you away i'll pull you back out when i get up to this view up here i'll talk to you guys soon i'm gonna you out How we doing guys, Bob Ganesh here. So we're at camp. We actually, it's, right now it's 6.45. We actually got here at 12.30 today. <laughs> uh, so we did all nine miles in basically four hours, four or four and a half hours. Uh, but we even stopped for lunch even halfway through at a really nice uh, overlook. So as you can see, we got camp set up. Uh, basically as soon as we got our stuff set up early this afternoon, uh, we had a huge thunderstorm roll through. So we had to hunker down for a couple hours. So we literally just slept for like two and a half hours. Finally, the sun came out, turned beautiful again. So we're just kind of hanging out. We're over here making some food. Obviously, we're walking away from camp. So we're over here making some food right now. I got all my stuff. I got to check on my stuff real quick, in fact. Um, see how that's going. Ooh. Oh, oh, it's coming along nice, folks. It's coming along nice. It looks delicious. Uh, Fred, what are we making tonight? Uh, pasta, cheesy broccoli pasta sides. Cheesy broccoli pasta sides. Nor rice sides. Delish. Yeah, we stopped this place in Harper's Ferry to resupply. Uh, so yeah, we're cooking food. It is our last night on the trail. Unfortunately, I have to say that. Our last night on the trail. It's a beautiful night. It's definitely uh, kicking, this things, kicking things off well. Um, we are expected to get some thunderstorms later, but a beautiful, beautiful night uh, right now afterwards and then tomorrow is supposed to be nice and clear we got penny lane coming over because i'm talking so all right guys let me put you away let me eat my food get some good grubbing to me get some good energy i'll catch you up with the guys before we start going to bed talk to you soon bob ganoos out how's it going guys bob ganoos here this morning this is our last morning on the trail we're just about packed up, getting ready to go here. We're getting picked up at the Washington Memorial around 12.30 or so. Uh, we have about three and a half miles till we get there. Uh, it's, so we're leaving, we're not getting started. We slept in a little bit. It's going on about 20 to 10. We don't even have to cook breakfast. We just have Pop-Tarts and stuff, so we'll get going nice and easy this morning. So yeah, we're just about ready to get out of here. We're gonna stop real quick down at the stream, just fill up our Nalgene's with water so we have plenty to uh, get to get to the memorial this afternoon and then that'll be it it's been a good week uh went by a little bit too fast uh but we had great weather really like that with the weather this week so we're happy about that you know yesterday was really the only time we had rain during the day really you know today it's drizzling a little bit but we're at it. we're heading out and it's really nothing to be concerned about anyway um so yeah we had great weather this week and normally we always get cursed with bad weather so we were, we were happy about this one. Good juju. Good juju. Good juju. So, all right, guys. Let me uh, let me put you away, filter water, get on out of here. I'll catch up with you guys further on down the trail. Bob, we're going to you out. Yeah. Yeah, how are we doing, guys? So we are at the end of our trip here. I'm walk Right now I'm walking up the inside of the Washington Monument. Washington Memorial, Monument, whatever it is. This is a hell of a way to end, end a nice long trip, that's for sure. So we got a beautiful view behind us here, getting up to the top. There we go. Oh yeah, get a look at this, guys. It's a little overcast, but you know what? It's beautiful behind me there. So this is a beautiful area. So yeah, this is, this is the end of our trip. It's definitely one way, one hell of a way to end it, that's for sure. So that's 65 miles over the course of the week, one zero day. Uh, we really lucked out with weather. Uh, met some really cool people along the way and also saw a uh, customer who comes into REI who had been planning his through hike. Just so happened to stay at the one shelter that we are at the one night. Hang lane, stay over here. So it was really cool that he was actually there. So, all right, guys, thanks a lot again for following along. It was a great trip. I'll talk to you guys soon. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me along on my next trip, next gear reviews. Talk to you soon. Bob Ganusha out.